Immigration and discrimination. They're two issues dominating news headlines lately, so it's no surprise that they were also chosen as the themes for TRT's International Documentary Awards. Elif Berriketli went to meet the winners at a ceremony here in Istanbul. Documentaries might not be the biggest draws at the box office, but they follow real people and tell real stories. They have developed into an important modern cultural medium. And that, in Turkey, is somewhat thanks to the national public broadcaster, TRT. When the state-run TRT was the only TV channel in Turkey until the 1990s, it served as a medium to introduce documentaries to the Turkish nation. And now it's holding one of the biggest documentary awards in Turkey. The scale is getting bigger and bigger each year. This year, more than 600 documentaries from 78 countries were submitted in the contest. The festival ended with a gala at Istanbul's Cemal Reşit Rey concert hall. Prizes were handed out for the best Turkish documentaries, the best documentaries from abroad and best student films. But it wasn't easy narrowing down the many entries. As a jury member, I can easily say we had a hard time this year. There were a lot of good movies. We're aware of our responsibility here. We know the importance of documentaries. We know how important this festival can be for documentary filmmakers. Because it's not easy to have a platform in this business. Polish director Anna Zameczka's debut, Komunia, took the top award in the international category. It's a coming-of-age story uh, with a teenage girl in the center, a uh, main character, her name is Zola, and uh, she dreams about perfect family uh, and she does everything uh, to make her dream uh, come true. Uh, so for instance, uh, she, uh, she's preparing her younger brother, a younger autistic brother, to the first Holy Communion and uh, she uses this um, uh, uh, this um, event, a uh, family event, as a pretext to bring the mother back. So this is her master plan. The best Turkish documentary went to Confrontation, a film about breast cancer. It was a tiring process to bring this film into being. Breast cancer is not easy at all. It's a deadly illness. It's an attack on your sexuality. My characters were sometimes discouraged because during that trauma, it's not easy to be a main character in a documentary. But I'm glad we achieved it. Now their voices are there to be heard. And that's what documentaries are for. They raise voices. The organizers stress the important role documentaries play in today's world. The fact that we're focusing on discrimination and migration this year is important for us. Documentaries are crucial in today's world because they're always in tune with the truth and they create our social memories. The documentaries explored many different worlds and spoke in many voices. But they brought everyone at the Scala together on one point, that documentaries matter. Elif Bereketli, TRT World, Istanbul.